Sasha has decided that she doesn't want to get out of bed. Don't know why. She just said I don't want to get out of bed just yet. So I came outside and I made her a banana, Weetabix and berry smoothie to start the day. It's thick. Perhaps too thick for such a thin straw. But it gives it more substance. I ended up making way more than I usually do. I don't know why, it's the same mix. It's like the milk foamed up or something. Let's take this in. Morning sleepyheads. You can stay in bed. Just enjoy a smoothie. And enjoy this smoothie too. Yeah, I am quite smooth. I'm just gonna go and get my smoothie. This door's really annoying. As we mentioned, Sasha has been soaking chickpeas so that we can make a more authentic hummus the next time or add it to chilies or add it to curry. In the UK we used to get through tons of chickpeas. We used to buy them in tins but out here they're really expensive or unless you buy them in dried bags like that but then they take up to three or four days to soak. It's long. So far, my plan for the day is to drink this smoothie and then go for a little swim. And then after that, I want to try and finish my edit for these tiny moments. I stayed up really late last night, but I think I might be able to get it finished and put it up tonight or either tonight or tomorrow so we can get it up over the weekend. That's the plan. If we get it done fast enough, we might be able to go and do something this afternoon. How's the weather? It's a bit stormy out. Just have to get on with things and see how the day pans out. This is real life in Thailand, people. Laundry, breakfast, normal things. <laughs> Anything that isn't normal, I guess having such a nice pool to jump in, although it could be for some. Uh, I procrastinated too long and now I cannot swim. To be honest, it was probably a bit too hot for it now anyway. It's actually still in bed. I'm gonna do some editing. Just finish my shower. Had a shave. It's already past lunchtime, and all I've had time to do today is household chores. So I'm going to start making lunch now. Sasha's still not come out of the bedroom. She's not feeling her best today. I think she's worried about everything that's coming up. So I'm just leaving her be. I'll take her some eggs, maybe some scrambled eggs. Hopefully she'll feel better this afternoon. Didn't manage to do any editing in the end. Okay, eggs. Got quite a few eggs. I think the key to managing lots of work is to wake up early. I wake up about 9.30, way too late. Nothing gets done. Everything gets messed up. So, waking up early is something I'm gonna practice on so that we can stay on top of things during this very busy period. I decided to add a bit of chicken mince to the scrambled egg or to the omelette. Put some protein. See how it turns out. She didn't want a cracker, so it was just egg. Not gonna let it go to waste though. I know, good girl. What have you done here? Have you lined up all your treats? Mm, but you won't eat them? No, I won't eat them. These are my chocolate drops. They're safe for dogs. By the way, these aren't human chocolates. Before somebody has a go at me. <laughs> 
I've decided to bring my computer in here so we can watch some Vikings. Yesterday I was up until 3 o'clock in the morning and we didn't get to watch Vikings. Hey, Sash. Mm. I said to Sash, I want to watch Vikings. She said, no, get on with your work. <laughs> so I've brought the computer in here now to make up for that. <laughs> We're going to watch it in the air conditioning and then afterwards I'll do some work. The defeat of Ragnar Lothbrok will resound down the ages. As my brother is still alive, he is not defeated. What is the point of making camp here? Vikings is finished for now. We'll take Eden for a walk. I'm really enjoying Vikings. We're on season four now. That was like two episodes from the last episode. It's getting quite exciting. I like the fact that it's based on real history too. All right, Eden, come in. Yeah. Did you enjoy Vikings? I don't care about Vikings. You take me out. Stormy sky didn't last. Now we have beautiful clouds. Don't know if you can see that. This is what I call an interesting sky. It's so much nicer than just having pure blue. But too bright to look at. It's pretty, isn't it? It's one thing I didn't like about North Thailand. At this time of year, you never get clouds like this. It'd look horrible. You'd, you'd get this in December, maybe. You have a visitor. Are you eating Eden's reject biscuits? She didn't want them, did she? Finish off the rest of that morning shake. So you just add water to it. Let's try it out, see if it's more edible. I had to finish the other one with a spoon because it got really thick the colder it got, the air conditioning on. Yeah, that's more like it. It's a drink now. Got some visitors. What are you doing in here? Why are you in the street? If Becky hears them, she'll come running down here, I'm sure. Don't let her find you. Sure you want goats <laughs> in the future? There's some sheep there too. This one's just done a poo right in front of the house. <laughs> oh my goodness. They're eating the neighbour's hedge. <laughs> this is interesting. Look at the sheep. The sheep don't want to come over. It's like they're the subordinates. They have to follow in the path. It's the goats first. They're all getting properly involved now. They've gone inside and everything. There you go. Mm. What you doing? Making cookies. It smells very vanilla-y. I forgot we had that vanilla extract in the cupboard. <laughs> Things go missing, don't they? <laughs> don't use them for a while. What have we got here? Cinnamon. Baking powder, oats. It's a secret basically. I can see some of these items. This looks like there was perhaps once a banana and egg. Banana and egg? <laughs> <laughs> Let's crack open cold soda water. I used to hate sparkling water, but then Sasha's younger brother, Paul, he always used to have it and I started drinking it and then I got used to it. So now, soda water is part of our regular shop. It's good. Getting my work done. These cookies that Sasha made are actually really good. A lot better than the ones I made the other day because the breakfast cookies can sometimes be a bit chewy. These ones taste a lot more like an actual cookie. So I'm enjoying that. Getting some editing done. Finally got round to it. It's now five o'clock, so in an hour we're going to be cooking dinner. <laughs> I'm going to try and get as much done as possible before then. Sasha has a daily vlog to edit, and I have these tiny moments to edit. So that's what we're up to at the moment. And guess what Eden's up to? Yeah, you guessed it. Nothing. Just resting. 
like a taxidermy. A pumpkin soup is being made out here. I can smell it. It's also got ginger in it, right? Is this an old, Ni is this an old Nigella Lawson recipe? It's a different one. I've been making it for ages. It's one of my favourite soups. Ginger, garlic and chilli and pumpkin, coconut milk, coriander. That's about it. Is this the one that, it's an English recipe that normally you put butternut squash in? Yeah. But you replaced it with the Thai pumpkin. Yeah. It's going to be good. We are now going to take Eden on a bit of a night walk. I have said this before in the vlogs and I strongly believe it till this day. Lint 70% dark chocolate is the perfect chocolate bar. It is definitely the best chocolate we've found in Thailand, at least, where the choice of dark chocolates is not great. We've been buying this bar since we came here and it's a really nice dessert. One square really is all you need. But I'm having an extra one tonight. Overload on the dark chocolate. And we couldn't leave Eden behind. Eden's having her own little chocolate drops. And these are safe for dog chocolate drops, not human chocolates. So don't worry people. I'm also upgrading Sasha's cookies that she made earlier. I've decided to put a little bit of dark chocolate inside them. Heat them up, let it melt and then devour. Time for dessert. While well, Jay is making the tea and getting ready to watch Vikings, I am gonna go ahead and end the vlog for today. Hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to this channel as well as our other channel, These Tiny Moments. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye.